Hey y'all and welcome back to the party. It's me, your girl, Britt Reacts, and today we are reacting to how Tom Segura wound up on a government watch list. <laughs> Let's see what he's gonna say, y'all. You seem like a very uh, law-abiding fellow that you recently got into tr some trouble at a bank. And I'm curious, how could that happen? You don't seem like the type. I know, I got in a lot of trouble, actually. Is that true? Yeah, um, so I was at the bank and I was thinking of one of my friends who's single, Ryan. What? And you know, he told me he's been single for a while and I saw the teller working, who's just, I don't know, an attractive woman. And <laughs> in my mind, I go, I'm gonna set him up on a blind date, you know? Mm -hmm. So and this I just, without talking to her or anything. Did you I, didn't, I didn't notice she wasn't her. wearing a ring. Yeah, or anything? yeah, that's it. No ring on her hand. So I call him. Guys, I don't know what's going on. It's fully loaded. I'm not sure why he's doing that. I will. I will let it have some more time to do whatever it needs to do and say that this man always seems to find himself in the stickiest of situations. And it's so wild to me, like to go into a bank and just look at a woman and be like, I'm going to set you up on a blind date with my friend is is bold. It's bold. I've never set anybody up on a blind date and I don't know like the criteria to do so, but to just look at someone and decide you're going like not having spoken to them, have any idea of their their character traits, their personality, nothing. You just decide. And in a bank at that feels a little not the right place. You know? But hey, who am I? Anything did you I didn't, I didn't notice she wasn't her. wearing a ring yeah, or anything? Yeah, that's it. No ring on her hand. So I call him, I go, I think I have a perfect blind date person for you. She works at the bank. And I think you should go on a date. And he's like, okay, uh, do you have a picture of her? Right. And I'm like, yeah, next to the picture of my gardener and my yeah. <laughs> yeah, I just keep pictures of random people. I don't people. have a picture of her. He goes, well, I'd like to see her before I agree to this. And Fair. I'm, like, I'm telling you, she's beautiful. He's like, no, nah, I need to see her. I'm like, okay, this is fair. forget it then. Yes. And then like a week later, I just, I'm back at the bank. I'm waiting in line. I'm on my phone. I see her and I just. Also, I don't go inside of the bank very often. I feel like maybe twice a year, I might have a reason to go in a bank. And I feel like you have to have a lot of money to have the need to go inside and deal with a bank teller. Or, you know, like my grandmother, she does not like machines. She is not into ATM. She thinks everything's trying to steal her social security number. And so she goes in because she wants to have that interaction with a human and get her money. Why are you in the bank once a week, Tom Segura? Why? I'm back at the bank. I'm waiting in line. I'm on my phone. I see her and I just pull up my phone. No. I snap a couple pictures of her. Not mm -hmm. the right place. <laughs> And I leave, mm -hmm. and then I get a call, and they're like, you were just at the bank? And I go, yeah, and thanks for the follow-up call. I appreciate it, I like your bank. And <laughs> they're like, no, we're from the security division of Wells Fargo, and why we have Fargo. photos and videos of you taking pictures in the bank today, uh, why are you doing that? And I go, uh, I panic, I was like, do you think I'm trying to rob the bank? <laughs> And they go, I don't know. Are you? <laughs> yeah. That's a fair question at this, this point. This is so, I, I'm with Conan. This is so fair. Why would you do, this just seems so wildly inappropriate, Tom. And they go, I don't know. Are you? <laughs> yeah. That's a fair question at this point. I guess. But I'm so nervous, I just go, no, I wasn't, I'm not trying to rob the bank. I was just taking pictures of that one teller. Um... <laughs> to send to my friend uh -huh. and they're like what <laughs> and I go well because I don't know I thought she was single and they go we don't appreciate our employees privacy being violated right and I go yeah I'm sorry you're right they go delete it and I go okay and then they go and now you're on the list and I go what list and they go it's a potential threat list uh, that all banks share is this real? This is real. All and banks, so like they're like you're not just all Wells Wells Fargo's, all banks. I mean, I'm I might give it to the bank security on this one because that just seems fishy. What would be the need? He should have really explained the, the maybe the blind date thing, and then maybe they would have understood. But like he didn't give a lot of context. All banks share. Is this real? This is real. And so they're like, you're just permanently a threat. Permanently to all banks. <laughs> And I'm like, am I allowed to bank here anymore? And they go, you have to work it out with that branch. So then I have to go into the branch. I sit down with the manager and I'm like, hey, 
I, I tell him the whole story. I go, I'm sorry. Uh, can I still bank here? And she goes, yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. And I was like, what? <laughs> I go, well I, well, I thought that I had to uh, clear it with you guys. She goes, you should probably clear it with Natasha. That's the girl. The actual teller. Uh, yeah. Hi, Natasha. Dang, I'm like, dang, you done told us this girl works at Wells Fargo. We can probably guess it's somewhere in California or wherever you live. Tom, take it easy. With you guys. She goes, you should probably clear it with Natasha. That's the girl. The actual teller. Uh, yeah. Hi, Natasha. So... <laughs> Then I go sit with Natasha and I tell her the whole thing. And I go, I'm sorry. You know, I was just trying to set you up on a date. Um, do you mind if I still bank here? And she was like, no. And I go, cool. Uh, do you, do you want to go on a date with my friend? <laughs> and she goes, do you have a picture of him? <laughs> and I, I actually do. So I was like, yeah. yeah. I showed her, and she goes, not my No. <laughs> didn't work out. Are but you still I, on the list? For I'm on a federal that's uh, amazing. threat watch list. Very so good. I, that's why I don't Venmo or PayPal anybody I'm not allowed to. You're not, that's, inc that's an incredible story. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. You idiot. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I can't believe it. What does Venmo or PayPal have to do with it? I hope that was a true story. I do. I hope it was a true story. Um, because it was funny. And Tom, you should know better. Do better, Tom. Oh, maybe he shouldn't be setting people up on blind dates. <laughs> All right, y'all. Go have the day you deserve. Peace.